In this series, we'll start with the basics and work our way up, exploring each era of the game, opening packs, building decks, and dueling with classic and modern cards. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just starting out, this series is for you. So stick around because the heart of the cards are calling, and together, we will become true duelists. Welcome to the Garbage Lords Progression Series. Well, Zach, this has been uh, an interesting time for you. Uh, you have yet another ban. It's been a while since you've had... Uh, have you ever had back-to-back -back bans? I think it... I am. Ne this is the first time in the series history. All right. Well, the win streak is is just going strong. But uh, you get a ban, and if you lose this next episode, you get two bans. Uh, so, hopefully, I don't have to deal with losing more cards in my collection. But Zach, what do you not want to deal with anymore? So, my knee jerk reaction was Sidra. Hit mm -hmm. Sidra, and then I thought about it more, and I was like, maybe I should go with my original. <laughs> Uh, ban and hit super rejuve because I have no copies of it. Mm -hmm. And then I thought even more and I was like, you know what? You know what's been historically strong, not only in this series, but in the history of Yu-Gi-Oh! in general mm -hmm. and has been on the Yu-Gi-Oh! ban list before? What's that? Blackluster Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning. Oh, we're taking that out. That's interesting. I mean, you got one very recently. I have one, but... It facilitates an entire deck building strategy, and with Valor now being viable, I just don't particularly like having such a big bomb that can completely change how the game is is going. It, it just it's a momentum swing, and I am not here for that. Yeah, I mean, I'm not like trying to toot my own horn, but I think every single time I've drawn BLS, it has mattered, and it is. I don't think I've won every game that I've drawn BLS, but it is. It's almost always just such a strong card. Free body, free banishment, uh, two attacks. It, it is a very crazy card. So, all right. Well, that makes our second ban card in a while. So we have, uh, was it Return from the Different Dimension and Blackluster Soldier Envoy of the Beginning ban. So a lot of chaos hits, but uh, let's get into today's duels. Well, boys, we did it. I uh, don't know what Zach is going to ban quite yet, but we're, we'll, we will see for sure. Um, but today we are going to focus on opening our packs. We've got Galactic Overlord and Raw Mellow, Raw Mellow, Raw Yellow Mega Pack. Uh, so this set is pretty good. Uh, we'll say that because uh, it does give us reprints of old cards that we didn't have a chance to. So all the Crystal Beasts except Pegasus doesn't matter. We have as many Pegasus as we want. Uh, we do get another shot at DD Crow, which we are still missing a third copy of. Uh, we get more shots at Hero Blast, which I think we have one of. So hopefully we pick up this. More copies of Light and Dark and Dragon are pretty cool. Uh, we get more chances at things like Super Poly, D-Draw, Mally, uh, Gardna. Uh, I think Zach, if he doesn't have a place out of Liquari, he could pick up more Liquari, but I don't know if he wants to. Uh, at the rare, uh, pretty much nothing here matters a ton. I mean, War Chariot is nice. Uh, the U-Bell stuff is pretty cool for when we get to the U-Bell support that is currently uh, out, but... Um, I don't think that'll matter for quite some time. Uh, ultra Rares, I mean, we get more shots at Wolf, uh, Jane. I mean, we have a playset of Lila Plus, so we don't really need more of it. But if we pick up a playset of Wolf, we might consider playing uh, Light Sworn, but it'd be a tough sell for me. Uh, more co uh, We get our first shot at D Prism. This card is insane. Uh, it is basically Bottomless and Saku rolled up into one, which is very, very powerful. Um, yeah, so we hope to pull a playset of this. In the comments, uh, we get shots at Card Trooper, DB Survivor, um, we get shots at Prisma and Stratos, uh, more shots at Mezuki for me, which is really good, more shots at Ryo for the both of us, this might be a card that doesn't last very long, uh, Shouldn't Doji is a very funny card, I like it, um, and that's about it. System Down, Rare Value, Power Bond, all those cards are pretty cool, but uh, let's talk about Galactic Overlords here. So Galactic Overlords is a very powerful set, um, but yet again, like almost all sets in Yu-Gi-Oh's history, very high rarity. Uh, Card Card D is a rare that is very powerful for stun strategies, kind of like Chain Burn, uh, but I don't think that's going to be very uh, impactful for us. It is a rare, so you're not guaranteed a playset of it. Uh, Hieratic Dragon of Tefnuit is in here along with the other Hieratics, this is a very powerful card, um, but you have to pull so high rarity for the Hieratics to be playable. Uh, we have Nightbeam, which is an incredibly strong spell trap removal. You target a set, 
and destroy it, your opponent can't activate the card in response. You can't do stuff like Chain Compulse. Uh, Hieratic Seals of Convocation is a uh, Rota for all the Hieratics, so it's a very powerful card. Uh, Rocket Arrow Express is a level 10 Earth Machine. It's fun. <laughs> um, but other than that, we have uh, nothing really in nothing really else here. Uh, in these super rares, we do have a couple very powerful cards. All right, so first off, Photon Strike Bouncer is a rank six. That is a negate. This is our first extra deck negate that we realistically have access to, not named uh, Nat Beast. Um, during either play's turn, when a monster effect is activated on your opponent's side of the field, detach material, negate the effect, and inflict a thousand damage to your opponent. It's a monster negate. It's really powerful. A uh, photon Papley operative is a level. There's a rank four that you just attach a material, target defense position monster, changes to attack, and if you do, it loses 600. So this lets you get over um, large defense monsters. Hieratic Dragon King of a Tomb is the reason to play the Hieratic Archetype. Uh, if you pull this either now or later when we get the Dragon Rulers, you are just winning the game. Uh, this card lets you summon a dragon from the deck for free uh, just by detaching a material. Um, and the only thing it does is it changes attack defense to zero. And then Guy Dragon the Thunder Charger is just a extra deck monster that can be slapped on top of a rank 5 or 6. And basically it lets you negate the problems of not having materials on an XYZ monster. In the Ultra Rare, we don't have a ton of stuff that we actually want. Um, so Hieratic Sun Dragon, Overlord of Heliopolis is a powerful card, uh, but a rank eight's pretty difficult to make even now. Uh, Insector Exostag is a pretty decent card for the Insector archetype. Uh, it is a rank five, detached material, target a card your opponent controls around their graveyard, equip it to this card, it gains attack. It's a decent. It's basically kind of like a DD Crow on legs. Um, it just sucks that it's kind of whippy. Uh, we have some more Galaxy Eye support. Uh, Force Focus is a strange card. I've never understood it. And Shark Drake is getting support in the TCG. Kind of cool. Into the commons, uh, honestly, we don't have a lot that's worth talking about here, but there is a good number of cards. So first off, we have uh, more Evolve support. Um, I'm going to be completely honest, I don't think any of this ever mattered. Uh, we do have more Insector support here in Ladybug, which is a very strong card for the Insector archetype. Zach's going to hold to pull a place out of this. And we have some other things like Earwig and Firefly that don't really change much, but are kind of interesting. Um, we have the more of the Hieratics. We have Eset, Nebthet, and Sue. Uh, these are all pretty powerful. Um, not insanely good, but are pretty strong. Uh, we have some other cards in here that don't really matter a ton. Evo Diversity is technically good for the Evolve deck. Um, that being said, it's Evolve's itself is not good. Uh, Berserker Skills is an interesting card. Uh, target a face of attack position monster you control against 1,000 attack. Cannot attack your opponent directly for the rest of the turn. During the end phase, it loses 2,000 attack. Basically, is a weird battle trick that lets you kind of just preserve your monster for the one turn. Uh, which might not sound that good, but in a but if you're playing like something like Clad Beast that can tag their monsters out at the end of battle phase, it's pretty decent. It's basically just a better rush recklessly. Uh, other than that, we don't have a ton of cards. I mean, Hieratic Dragon Seals of Supre or Hieratic Seals of Supremacy is a decent card for the Hieratic archetype, uh, but not super insane. So that is that. Let's go ahead and get into our packs. We're opening 24 booster packs each. Let's start with our raw yellow. Mega packs. In a world where I only open bricks and he opens power one ofs, I am hard stuck with six extra packs. Not of raw yellow, but Galactic Overlord, which doesn't really matter. Um, we're going to start with raw yellow. Um, the set is fine. We get the Crystal Beast. We get some weird commons. Um, like Grandmaster's cool, but we already had that. Fissure, we already had. It's basically just here for the U-Bell stuff for when U-Bell comes out, as well as War Chariot at, at Rare is nice. Another Prisma is also kind of nice. Um, Miracle Fusion's decent. Shogun, I don't think that... Or Shogun Chien, I don't think we had any access to. Hero Blast, I, we definitely had before. More Snake Deity. Just some more... I mean, Dim Fusion's nice. Same with System Down. He gets another uh, shot at more Crows. Uh, Stratos is also pretty cool. Um... Gateway is perpetually banned. Um, Light End Dragon is nice. I think we already had one, um, but yeah. Uh, maybe we'll play Light Sworn sometime. 
Um, when they start to roll off the ban list, who knows? A wolf is pretty cool. Regular Ubel. I think we have two regular Ubel, which is nice. Um, but we want a Terror Incarnate. There, Speak of the Devil. Another Jane. Necrogardena is pretty sweet. Um, we have Oversoul. Alias, uh, Zanji, Kasha, uh, Kamon, Trooper, all this stuff. Another Jane, Ecall, Plasma, Kamon, uh, Lenista. This is the bad one, a bad one, right? Special summon, target one in your graveyard, banner those targets. Um, yeah, it's bad. Power Bond's also pretty sweet. Um, I think this is like I think that all the stuff in, in this besides gateway is like first wave of support, but this will get his pool up to scratch with ours. Um, Grand Convergence is pretty cool. Mali again, but we already I think that was printed common, so we already had plenty. Like this is just a bunch of reprints that we already kind of had outside of the Light Sworn stuff and the U Bell stuff. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to be saving this because why would I not? Like, out of the Light Swarms, we got uh, Garoth. Um, we got an Alias. I think we already had a playset. Double Wolf, which is very nice. Lumina, as well as Jane. Like, I think that now, with this, we finally have a playable set of uh, Light Swarms, which are a fairly decent car uh, set of cards. As well as Gallus. Gallus is quite nice, actually. Yeah, I like that a lot. All right. Um, add to the collection. Return to Pack Simulator. And then we got to scroll down forever. And oh, we already got there. Um, we got thirty packs of this. And flippity doo da! Oh my goodness, we already got a bad card. Um, Gebeb is pretty bad, if I remember correctly. Uh, but yeah, Sue and Nuit is quite nice. The Hieratic, oh my gosh, we got a Gaia Dragon, the Thunder Charger already. Um, lady, thank you, Lady. I like Lady. Lady is great. Zect Conversion. This is a very bad card. I will read it for you guys. When a face-up insect you control is targeted for an attack, target the attacking monster, equip the attack target to that attacking monster, take control of the equip. It's just, it's a snatch steal with extra stats, and it's not even very good. It's really just fine, but an asset and a Sue is quite nice, as well as Supremacy. Um, seal of uh, Convocation is decent as well as another Lady uh, Storm, also a very good card. Uh, we got Giga Cricket, Mini Guts. We have whatever the heck this is. Uh, Watt Tail is quite nice, as well as that. So Watt Tail in this just allows a lot of the uh, Hieratics to be able to go into a six-axis deck, which is quite good. We got a Neb uh, another Lady. Another Giga Cricket, not a good card. Uh, we definitely have a playset of Lady by now. Another Watt Dragon, we have a Tasuke Knight. Um, your opponent controls, or your opponent monster declares an attack. Well, you have no cards in your hand. This card is in your graveyard. You can special summon this card from your graveyard and end the battle phase. Bad battle trick. Um, another Convocation is quite nice. Ooh, we got an Exostag. So this is a decent rank 5. Um, just once per turn, detach one material, target a monster your opponent controls or in their graveyard. Equip that target to this card. Um, this card gains attack and defense equal to half the original attack and defense of the equipped card. It's non-target or it, it's targeting, but um, non-destructive removal, which is quite nice. Overlay Eater is a bad card, and Pack Filler. We already have a Neo Galaxy Photon Dragon. That is fantastic. So this is only really good in Hieratics right now. Oh, I guess we do have two. Um, to get maybe um yeah earwig is bad we have swallowtail butterspy um more of the guys another convocation 
I have never seen this card in my life. You can special summon this card by banishing one light dragon and one dragon type normal monster from your graveyard. If this face up card on the field is destroyed, you can tribute one face up hieratic monster instead. Accept this card. Okay, another Sue is decent. I don't know why that one's super. Another guy a dragon. Sure. Um, so guy dragon can equip onto or can rank onto a level five or six, and it's just a big guy that does piercing. Um, Asset, as well as a red-headed Oni, which is a very good card. Um, unfortunately, I don't think that we have the tools to be able to utilize that quite yet. Um, Draco Nection. Reveal one dragon-type monster in your hand. Add one dragon-type monster with the same level from your deck to your hand. Then shuffle the revealed monster into the deck. Um, so that can help us in exactly... Um, what's this phrase? Uh... Uh, Hieratics to be able to get our normals out of our deck, but I don't think that's worth playing. Final Insect uh, Buten is a good card. Or it was a lot better when Baron was legal. Um, but now it's just okay. Man. All the hollows were in the first half of this set. We haven't seen a single one outside of the bad shuffle back boy. Okay, so... All in all, that was very decent. We got an Exus Tag. We really don't need two of these. All of these kind of suck. Um, all of the or these two kind of suck. That's decent though. Um, a lot of hollows, like an absurd amount of hollows. We're gonna add this to the collection because we got a playset of uh, Ladybug. We got four. We also managed to get five, six, five, um, and six of the good Hieratics as well as Wattail Dragon. Um, but it might be worth playing the seal instead. And I think we also got three convocation, which is a very good card. Um, basically just the rota for the deck, but not once per turn. So Hieratics, definitely a decent deck that we can try and do, but we don't have anything to go into with that. So we're going to add this to the collection and move on with our lives. Let's flip it up. Uh, Super Poly is good. Um, I, I, Pegasus is in here? I didn't even see it. Uh, System Down is good, though. There's a Jane. There's a Destiny Draw. There's a Gallus. I kind of actually want to pull a place out of this. That'd be really nice. Uh, Stratos, another Dark End. Second Jane. Uh, there's Rainbow Neos. So that's kind of cool. Uh, too bad you can't super, or mirror, mirror Confusion into it. There is our third DD Crow, finally. And there's a D Prison. Not bad. It's a, definitely our third Ryo, for sure. Is a Laquari, another War Chariot, Test Tiger, second Gallus. God, are we going to play Glad Beast? I don't want to. Uh, we already have a place out of Instant Fusion. Nothing here really matters. Uh, there's a Mizuki. That's great. Another Lumina. We really don't need that. Uh, second Mizuki, though. I think it's limited, but it doesn't matter. It's really good for a long time. Uh, another Test Tiger. Second Necro Garden is fine. Third Dark End. We could really use some other cards. Uh, there's our fourth Judgment Dragon. We might end up playing Light Swarm just for, just for the lols. Uh, Crystal Beacons, whatever. There's, I think, our, there's another Card Trooper. Don't think we need that, though. I think that's our second Hero Blast. Fucking finally. There's our third Gallus. Not bad. Uh, second D Prison is amazing. It's like our fourth copy of Super Poly. There's a shit in Doji. Uh, I like that for the zombie decks. Okay. Place it of Hero Blast. Finally, we can play heroes. Uh, let's see. Anything else? Nothing here. It's like our 15th copy of Super Poly. Well, if we didn't have enough Cydras, uh, there's, I think, our fourth Gallus, but it might be our third. There's our third Mizuki. Uh, Hero Flash is a funny card. Uh, that doesn't seem very good. It's like our fourth Dark End. Can we get something else? Uh, yeah, we can get a fifth Dark End. <laughs> All right. Uh, this was pretty solid. We got pretty much everything I wanted. Uh, we got Shindojis. We got Mizukis. We got uh, Galluses. We got um, Hero Blasts. We got Double... Uh, dimensional Prison, that's going to be insane going forward. We got our third DD Crow. I'm happy with this. Let's add it to collection and let's get into our 24 packs of Galactic Overlord. Wherever it is, there it is. 
24 packs. All right, we might be re-rolling this unironically, so let's go ahead and get into it. All right, flip them up. There's a Nebthet, not terrible. Evo Diversity is not really where you want to be. Nothing there. All right, there's a Tefnuit, and there's another S set. I know we have one Nebthet and one S set. Okay. There's a Ball, and there's a Seals of Supremacy. Nothing there. I always think this is Moonlit Butter Spy. It's not, uh, which is means it's not a good card. There's our second S set, and there's a Watt Tail Dragon. That's decent. Light Ray Sorcerer is not really want to be. Uh, second Neb that I think is not terrible. Another Seals of Supremacy is bad. Uh, fine. Uh, there's a Convocation. That's not bad. There's a Sue. Is that our first Sue or is that our second? That's our first Sue. That's really unfortunate. There's a Seal of Dragon King. I mean, I guess that's a thing. Uh, there's a newest. I don't think that's good at all. Uh, a little bit over halfway through. Not happy with this. Second newit. Newit. Uh, okay, so there's a tough newit. There's the Ghost Rare Photon Dragon. Um, yeah, this is not good at all. Uh, it's really not. Uh, that's very unfortunate. Butterfly Yoke, I think, is an actually like a decent card. There's our third S set. What does Butterfly Yoke do? I always forget what this card does. It's pretty bad. That's what it is. It's pretty bad. Uh, there's a Night Beam. I mean, I guess that's fine, but we haven't seen any super rares. But we've seen one. It's Bound Wand. Uh. Nothing here, really. Light Ray Sorcerer? There's like our third copy of Nebthet, our fourth copy of Asset. I think we still only have one Sue. We have two Tefnuit, though. But Sue is like the good one. Uh, knew it. Yeah, I don't think that's that's very good. Alright, three packs left. Oh, that's our like first photon papal operative. That's really unfortunate. There's another seal of supremacy. Nothing here. And nothing there either. Okay, we gotta think about this real quick. It should be no surprise to anyone that we are playing in sectors once again, um, especially because I quite literally told you guys, hey, I'm going to play in sector until it's banned. Um, and it's not banned yet, so I'm going to play it. Yes, we lost last episode, but I feel like our deck is far, far better and less bricky this time. Um, and that's because we have access to triple ladybug. So I'm just going to do the quick card by card, talk about a few things, and then we will jump into the games. Everything is pretty much the same as last episode, so you guys can refer back to that deck profile, and this one just kind of adds on. So we have, uh, same as last episode, we got Dad, Triple, Centipede, Double, uh, Dragonfly, and then we also have Hornet Hopper. I'm still on Hopper because Hopper is... It's just a replacement for the second copy of Hornet, which we do not have. I like having two Hornet, but eh, it's whatever. Um, I am on Weevil and Gigamantis. I was playing two Mantis before, but I don't want to break on this. And uh, Ladybug increases consistency enough to where I don't feel like I need this. Um, most people weren't on Weevil because people were afraid of not having attack points. But I just want to be able to trigger Reborns twice, so that's why it's here. Um... We're also on Ladybug. This card is basically Hornet um, in that everything from here to here is the exact same as Hornet, except for this number right here, uh, two instead of three. And that's because it increases the level by its level, which is two, and Hornet is, of course, a level three. <sighs> Mind blown. Um, the effect to de-equip and do something is different. Um, 
when this card is equipped to a monster, you can send it to the graveyard, target a face-up monster you control. It doesn't have to be the equipped monster, making it infinitely better than Hopper. Um, and then you increase the target's level by one or two. So you can target uh, Air Bellum, increase its level by two, make it a five, and then you can instantly go for an eight. Pretty good, pretty nice, I like it. Um, but also, it just makes it so that we can access the rank four and five pool a lot easier. But it also means that we have to play ranks fours and fives because if we normal Dragonfly, Dragonfly effect, equip Lady, Lady effect, increase the level by one or two, and then Dragonfly to special summon a Centipede. The, the level of the Dragonfly is now four or five, depending on what we want to go for. So we need to play fours and fives. Um, making Ladybug not quite as good if we didn't pull exactly Exastag, but I will get to that in a minute. Um, then we're still on the Mystic Tomato to go into uh, these two, this guy, or this guy, or more importantly, Sangan. Sangan can also go into the same uh, the, the same cards that I just previously mentioned, but it can also go into Rescue Cat, which I forgot about and might have won me a game, but I don't know. I In watching them back, my situation was very hopeless. I was very down bad on resources. Um, but our cat targets have changed. We're only playing one X Saber in Air Bellum. Um, and we have eschewed the others for Gallus the Star Beast. This is a level three Earth Beast um, non-tuner that has the effect to, uh, there's no hard once per turn on this card. There's no once per turn on this card. You reveal this card in your hands, send it to, send the top card of your deck to the graveyard. Then if it was a monster, inflict damage to your opponent equal to the level times 200 and special summon this card. Otherwise destroy this card. So you must mill a monster and destroy the card or, and deal damage, or this card is destroyed. Um, there were some funny FTKs with this, but those aren't good and inconsistent, especially when we only have two Gallus um, and two of the uh, one of the other pieces in um, Gen X Satellite Birdman, and we don't even have the Kawaki Maro, which require which you require to be able to play that. Um, anyways, we're on one heavy and triple MST because I really, really, really want to see my back removal. Unlike last episode, we are still on the double cyclone, but not on the emergency provisions. And uh, I was thinking, or I, I was going to swap this card out for Storm, but Storm is far worse than I thought it was. It's basically a bad heavy Storm. Um, it reads, destroy as many spell traps you control as possible, then destroy as many uh, spell traps your opponent controls as possible, up to the number of cards you destroyed by this effect. It's just a bad heavy Storm. It's a non-quick play, and it also is a mandatory pop all cards you control. So if we have cards in the back row that we want to keep then we have to destroy them whereas this is targeted and a quick play it's just better we're still on the mine con the reborn the, the lance the upstart the double bottomless the double uh haunted the one mirror force and the judgment which we will never see ever again sad face um but we're also on deep prison this came with gallus in the raw yellow mega pack um which is such a welcome change. Um, in the side, we have double T-Roar, triple Dust Tornado, one Pashul to go into Nat Beast. I was thinking about putting this in and then just being able to like access uh, Ladybug lines to increase the level, but that just feels really, really bad. Uh, and I don't want to do that because it requires us to have both Cat and a way to get Ladybug's effect off, which requires two normals and we don't have double summon, so no. Um, we're still on Triple Ryo. This card is so fun. You can tell how enthused I am. Um, we're still on Triple Valor and Triple Crow. In the extra, we have one Cataster, one Nat Beast, one Barkeon, one Brio. Quick thing about this. I said last episode that Brio would be banned next episode. I was wrong because uh, the card that is banned is Trish, um, which actually means that... Uh, the next, uh, I'm just going to go through the next, uh, which is Uo Quiznos. We have Black Rose, Scrap Dragon, only one Stardust for the first time in, I think, this, since the start of Heckin' Synchro era. And we're not playing Trish, we're going to be playing Mistworm instead. So, Mistworm. And then we're on every single XYZ that is generic, except for the second copy of Gaia Dragon. Uh, those, of course, being Leviathan Dragon, Leviathan, Zen Mains, 
Zen Meister, this is important because of the thing I talked about where we, we need to have rank fours and fives, and this is the only generic rank four we have. Um, Exostag, which is uh, basically just Snatch Steel. Um, it's non-destructive removal, it's just good. OPT, Detach One, uh, it's a rank five that requires two five insects, which is very easy to access in this deck. Um, Detach one, then target a monster your opponent controls. Equip that card to this card, and the attack, um, and this card gains attack and defense equal to half the original attack and defense of that card. So if you attach a 3k monster, then it's, a, it's um, attack goes up to 2300, which is not that high. So that's why we have Gaia Dragon to just go over it, because it can it can only be XYZ summoned um, on top of a rank five or six, and then you attaches material as it so you basically just in paper you have the stack of like uh one material and one xyz and then you just put the gaia dragon over it and then it just does piercing to a defense position um but yeah that's the deck i really am excited to actually play a competent insector deck and i will see you guys in the games <laughs> all right boys so i'm Honestly, not sure about this one, but we're going to do it because it's going to be funny. Welcome to the FTK. So we kind of gentlemen out of uh, the last FTK we could play, which is Frog FTK. But this is Gallus FTK. This one arguably requires less setup. All you have to do is get a Quakimur Doom on the field and have a Gallus and Birdman in hand. Uh, we'll talk about that combo a little bit if we get to it, but the point is... Quacky Mirror Doom prevents dark monsters from being summoned, which is Birdman. However, Birdman's return to the hand is a cost, and it's not once per turn. So, if you have a Gallus in hand and a Quacky Mirror Doom on field, uh, you can activate Gallus, mill a card, summon it, and then burn uh, for the uh, damage. And then you can Birdman return the Gallus to the hand. The Birdman doesn't get summoned, so then you can Gallus again, and then you're at the same board state. So, the way that you capitalize on this is by playing nothing but monsters. <laughs> Absolutely nothing but monsters. You do not want to see any cards that are not orange. And we are going to be essentially doing that. So this is also Monster Mash, but this is just Gallus FTK. So getting into the card by card, we have BLS, we have Double Caius, we have Double Card Trooper, Triple Cyber Dragon, uh, the Dark Armed, the Double Doppel Warrior, the Effect Failure, the Gallus, the uh, Birdman, Junk Synchron, Quacky Mirror Doom, Level Eater, Double Mystic Tomato, one Obelisk the Tormentor. This is in here just because, in theory, we might actually be able to get it off. If we have something like uh, Junk Synchron, revive a card, and then make, and then revive Quillbolt, we could just summon Obelisk, but it, it might be hard to get to. Plague Spreader, Triple uh, Quick Draw Synchron, Quillbolt Hedgehog, Raiko, and Sangan. In the side, we got triple DD Crow, uh, triple Mobius. This gives us uh, kind of a back row hate that isn't uh, spell trap removal. Uh, Necro Gardena, double Sasuke Samurai number two. This is Cold Wave on a body. Uh, so pretty strong when you're only playing monsters. Uh, Swift Scarecrow, triple Ryo, and the only spell trapper playing is a single copy of Heavy Storm in case Zack is bringing a trap strategy. More than likely he won't, but just in case we, we have it. In the extract, we have Cataster, Ally of Justice, Decisive Armor. This is actually a really, uh, really strong card. Uh, it is absolutely just demolishes if you uh, if your opponent is using light monsters. Uh, Armory Arm, Black Rose, Brio, Drill, uh, Formula, Inferni, Doom Dragon. We can actually make this. We have a couple of Dark Tuners, namely Junk Synchron and Plague Spreader, so it might come up. Junk, Syn or Junk Archer, I should say. Magical Android, Mist Worm, Road Warrior, uh, Stardust. Leviar and Leviathan. So that is it. Let's get on to the duel. Well, Zach, uh, it's time. Uh, let's let's get into it. Uh, you banned BLS. You banned uh, you banned Return for the Different Dimension. And uh, my chaos pool is just it's not there anymore. It's not there anymore. I'm sad. <laughs> no, uh, this set. Look, what what set did we open? Which set was this? Uh, is um, Galactic Overlords. Good question. I feel like that's it. I don't know. Was it? It's been. Yeah, like it was. It was. Yeah. It was the Mega Pack and Galactic Overlords. Yeah, I mean, I don't really remember too much from this set. I don't feel like there was much that was like very impactful. But there's one card that's gonna be very impactful for you, and I, I think we're going to see 
see it here in a bit. Let's go ahead and get on into the RPS and, ooh, let's see. Oh. Ay oh. Yeah, all right. Um, I, we're going to, uh, we're going to attempt to go first and see how we do. Do it. All right. Ooh, all right. Draw phase, draw for turn. We still get to do that. Oh. Uh, standby main phase. Uh, you know what? We're just gonna, we're just gonna normal summon this card trooper and we're gonna activate the effect. Just get some cards yep. on the graveyard. Isn't Trooper at two now? It is at two. Um, <laughs> oh, what the? What? What? What the? What the? Huh? What the? Huh? <laughs> what the? Huh? You weren't supposed to see that. Uh, anyways, all right. Uh, let's just pass turn. Uh, this loses the attack at the end of this turn. Yeah. So it's still at four hundred. Four hundred. All right. Stand by main. Yeah. Um, I'm going to start off by declaring Gallus the Star Beast. Bro, what the fuck? All right. Sure. Okay. Hey! Oh, actually, so that's, that's not good. Yes. All right. Um, that's actually kind of poopy. Uh, I'm just gonna. This is unfortunate. Normal summon a lady. Sure. Wait, what? Overlay. How are you? For. Could oh. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Do we step? <laughs> Oopsies! Oh, it's all right. I'll, uh, I'll well, I already normal this, so that's fine. Uh, yeah, I'll get my draw. Right, I'll take four hundred and five hundred. So I'll take nine hundred total. I'll get my draw. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Okay. A lot of back row there. Not happy about it. You uh, should pass and discard your hand size. Uh, standby main. Okay. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. All right. Um, well, uh, we're going to start off by specialing a card that you almost banned. Here's the Cyber Dragon. Ah, uh, yep. I mean, that is indeed a Cydra. It's kind of like, I, I don't mean to be like mean, but we kind of just like knew it was coming, right? <laughs> yeah, we did. Uh, let's run out the sand, Dan. And we'll go to battle. Uh-huh. Uh, I'll try and hit into the Gallus for 200. Um, this is just too juicy. I'm a Dimpra, is this? Oh, and that doesn't trigger. Damn. Uh, banished. Yeah, good card. New card. Uh, first time we've had a chance yeah. to get this. Um, great card. Uh, I guess we'll just declare or we'll try and hit into the ladybug. Okay. Um. So how much is that? I take 16. what? Sixteen. Yeah. Uh, second main. Gosh, that's kind of rough. All right, go ahead. Yeah. yeah. I'll draw. Yeah. Um. Hmm. Draw. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, standby main phase. You just drew heavy, didn't you? I did not just draw heavy, unfortunately. All right, so we're gonna do. We got some fun plays here. All right, so let's let's go ahead and uh, we're gonna normal summon this junk synchron and declare the effect. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we're going to special summon this effect veiler. All right, and then because a card was special oh. summoned from our graveyard, oh doppel, I will trigger the effect of doppel warrior to special summon it. Yep. Okay. Uh, now let's go ahead and special summon in defense because we control a tuner. This quillbolt hedgehog. Mm-hmm. Now, what do we do? Now we got some fun things to do. Um, Pass. You wish. <laughs> I really do. Um, okay. Uh, let's see if we can do that. Yeah, okay, let's do this. Let's do this. 
All right, so we're gonna start by synchroing off this junk synchron and we're gonna synchro junk, quillbolt and doppel to grave for archer. And we'll trigger doppel um, to get two I have to bottomless this here. Ooh, yes you do, all right. We still will trigger doppel to get two tokens. Yeah. All right. Uh, the token. Tokens are the level one warriors. Um, yeah. Okay. Four hundred attack and defense. Get rid of the one of the tokens and the Valor for a formula. Uh, Mr. Crab's mm -hmm. effect to draw. Yeah, sure. Okay. Let's see. What can we do here? Unfortunately, the answer is like just not a lot. Make an eight. Uh, unfortunately, that's not a thing. Okay. All right. I guess we'll just go for it. We will get rid of the token, the um, Sidra, and the formula. We'll make Stardust. Anything yep. here? Uh, nope. All right. Uh, we'll go battle phase. I will attack into a Gallus. Yes. Second main, uh, I normal summoned the junk, so we'll go ahead and just pass turn. Uh, is this... Ah, okay. This Quillbolt is banished, however. Because of its own effect. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, set pass. Sure, draw. Uh, standby main phase. Um, let's just go battle phase, and I'll hit you for 25. I'll take 25. Second main, I'll just set a card and I'll pass the turn. Oh, this is exactly where I want to be. Standby main phase. Can we just wrap it up? We might be able to. Well, let's see. Uh... Yeah, let's let's try for it. Uh, we'll start by flipping Raiko. We'll pop the set monster whenever he wants to catch up. <laughs>
Yay! I, I do not have response here. Oh, yes. Uh, set that. Um, Hornet effect target the new set. Sure. It go bye bye. Okay. Um, effect of Santa. Yeah. Do add an exact. Yep. Go for it. Well. Add a drag by you normal Santa. Okay. Yeah. Twenty five. Twenty five. Sixteen. I know you don't have anything else, I'll pass. Alright, draw. Um, hmm. Okay. Do I have any way to do that? No, not really. Okay. Um, we'll just set a card and we will, uh, we'll pass it up. Unfortunately. Oh, you're so kind. Uh, stand by main, center effect. Mm hmm. Hornet? Uh, Hornet effect. Yep, to the grave with the global hedgehog. And then center effect. Yep. Um, I'm going to grab to hand Giga Weevil. Sure. Uh, normal dragonfly. Yep. Dragonfly effect. Yep. Uh, Weevil effect, target the fly. Sure. A hornet effect target weevil. Sure. Um, we're just gonna do one, two, no weevil effect. Sure. One and do we do that? I could do that, but that's not. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. Um, sure. Do I centipede here? What's the value of doing that? Is this just lethal? Uh, yeah. I'm seeing six. I'm I'm seeing at least six thousand damage on field, and that's just from counting the the fourth digits. <laughs> lethal. Yep. You... All right. All right. Game three, game three. Uh, I, I, I just realized you're playing 41 cards. I am, in fact, playing 41. Right. Huh. Draw phase, draw for turn. Uh, stand by mm -hmm. into the main phase. Um, yep. Hmm. Huh. Okay. You know what? Um, I am just the most confident boy. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. Uh, all right. Let's uh, let's see. I will. Gosh, do I want to do that now? Now you know what. I'm just so confident. I'm so confident. Let's just go. <laughs> okay. Let's run the Gamba. You've mind uh, two yeah. of my guys now. I do not want to give you more fuel for the fire. I only mind conned one guy. What are you talking about? Uh, oh, that's true. But still, that was a, that was a bad mind con for me. <laughs> I'm gonna set three and pass. Sure. Draw. Standby main phase. Oh, dude, this is this is gonna be so fucking funny. All right, all right. Um, we're gonna special quick draw by pitching Quillbolt. Oh, that's very good. Um, we will special summon Quillbolt because we control a tuner. Yes. Uh, because our monster was special summoned from our graveyard, I will special summon Doppel Warrior. Okay. Uh, let's see. What can we do? Oh, that's so funny. Uh, oh, we can't do that. That's very unfortunate. Huh. Is there any way we can get this going? Um, I feel like we gotta we gotta do this smart here. The smart thing is passing. No, 
No. Um, yeah, we're going to sink these two off for Archer. And then Doppel effect okay. to get two tokens. Yeah, okay. Um. Nib. <laughs> Shut up, man. <laughs> you have no idea how afraid I am of, like, Torrential right now or something stupid. Um. Torrential's at two. It is at two, yeah. That's why it's freaking scary. Uh, okay. You know what? I don't think I'm going to get another chance to do this. So, let's see. Yep. Uh, these tokens technically do go in attack position, but I am going yes. to tribute all three <laughs> for Obelisk the Tormentor! Damn it! <laughs> Fuck. I would, I, a hundred percent, I thought you were going to bottomless the- Oh, wait, I actually can't do that. Oh, it's unaffected by traps. It's that. unaffected by traps. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, whoops. Oh. Uh. Oh my gosh! It's actually I no, I can't activate cards. Um, when this card is is summoned, cards and effects cannot be activated, so I can't do that. <laughs> oh, let's go! All right. Um, thinking here now. Let's see, so this is four, six, sixty-three. Uh, this quibble is banished. Use my normals. So uh so that's Okay, so Alright, we're I think I think we're gonna go for it because I I think I have to. I think I think this might be lethal if I hit good enough. I will reveal Gallus. <laughs> Sure. Oh, that's oh, uh, that's twelve, right? That's uh, it's a thousand because it's two times. 12. Oh, a thousand because it's it's five. Um, yeah, yep. okay. I will go to battle phase. <laughs> Try okay. for eight hundred. Yep. Try for twenty one. Uh, I know you fuck them all. Oh, shit. All right, fine. Uh, try for four K <laughs> with Opalus. Oh, that was almost lethal. Almost lethal. I couldn't dim prison because I can't target it, which is annoying. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Uh, I want to see how you get out of this one. Uh. 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 All right. Um. Oh. Oh man. Oh gosh. Uh. Okay. Standby main. Mm -hmm. Um. I will return Gallus to hand to special Birdman. Ah. Uh, yep. I'll reveal Gallus. Gosh, well, dang it. That one is six. Yep. Um, oh, do I go for, like, the the big play? That's the question. I mean, you literally could just tribute to destroy all monsters and then go lethal. No, this card can't attack the turn you With do that. Problems. That's the problem. Oh. I could I could essentially like set this up to be a like you have three like you have three to buy three. Um okay. Uh yeah. we're going to sink these two into Brio. Anything here? Um Yeah, you know I have it. Yeah, I kinda wanted to just beam that out. Um okay, so to the to the banish zone with you. Uh, unfortunately, it's still really good. Train. 
All right, I guess I'll go battle and I'll try and hit over whatever this is. It's a crow. All right. And you're gonna hit over. It's 4K, my it guy. It is 4K. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to think how you like get out of this. I I really don't know. Uh, by drawing another card. Yeah, go for it. Um. Jesus Christ. Oh, okay. Draw. Not being able to target is the worst part, honestly. Yeah, that's why wow, this is so good. Uh, all right, uh, we'll just go battle phase, and I'll just try and hit over. Mm-hmm. Second main, go ahead. I have nothing else. Okay, um, normal summon Santa. Sure. Santa effect. Yep. For Hornet. Oh, was not expecting that. Weevil effect. Okay, yeah, sure. Hornet target Weevil. Hornet target. Yeah, I can't do anything about that, can I? Uh, Weevil 1, target Senta, Senta 2, Senta 3. Uh... So Weevil 1, target Senta, and Senta 1. I think that's fine, I, I think. <laughs> it's so hard to tell sometimes with this deck. Uh, yeah, go for okay. it. Okay, um... God, I don't know what I grab. How the heck do I out this? Is it like... Um... I think it... I'm not, like, trying to help you, but is it, like, Giga Mantis equipped as Centipede and then just crash? Giga Mantis makes the attack, original attack, 24. Oh, I thought it added. Doesn't oh. gain that. No. I think I just have to play for time? So I'm going to grab Fly. Sure. And grab... A lady. Sure. And the Senta gets special. I'm going to put it in defense. Sure. Um. Senta effect. Sure. Cool. Equipping, screw it, the Giga Weevil, because it's funny. <laughs> it is funny. Um, I just wanted to see if I could bait out anything before going into Monsieur Zen mains. Yeah, and this card also does not... Do, this it, card does, also does it does target, target. so that's kind of hard. Yes, so I, I don't know what to do. Ah. <laughs> uh. Everything I have frickin' targets. <laughs> well, not everything, but most things. I need to draw exactly one specific card, and then I, I'm out of this. Yeah. So, like, here's the weird thing, is, like, Zen Mains is mandatory. Yes. So... And I can't target it. You can't so I have to target the card on like, my field. Back row or itself, which is, like, really weird. Yes. Um... I don't really want to do that, though, because I feel like I'm just, like, playing into your hand. And my hand is not very good, I'll tell you that much. Um, I know your hand is Fly Ladybug. Yes. Uh, I've seen the Bottomless and a Deep Prison out of you. I don't have anything in Grave I can really use. Shitty part is that he dies. 
you know what? I'm actually just going to... I, I kind of want to play this safe. It's like, it's, it feels so stupid to do this, but this is what I'm going to do. It's like, I've got a four. Okay. Um... It's like, I, I, I know that like these could be mirror force and mirror force. I think is the only thing that outs this. Yes. So I'm like, why don't I just sit on the body? <laughs> so it's like, it's, it's a weird decision for sure, but it's what I'm going for. Okay. Um, you know what? There's no time like the present. Let's show off the funny. Uh, sure. I'm going to normal summon dragonfly. Sure. Dragonfly effect. Yeah. Going to equip lady. Mm -hmm. Lady effect target dragonfly. Mm -hmm. Increased by two late, uh, dragonfly effect. Yep. Uh, special summoning Santa Santa effect. Santa piece fine. Equip the lady. Uh, lady effect. Yep. Target Santa. Increase by two. What are we making a five? <laughs> we, I, I mean, I literally like have to with that. Yeah. There are um, level five insectors, or rank five insectors, so. I'll grab this. Yeah, there's the mantis. I will overlay for Exostag. Sure. Uh,. Exostag effect detaching the fly, targeting the face down. Trolls or in their graveyard equip that target. To the oh, wait. Hmm. You can't equip from graveyard. Hold on. Yeah. Yeah, I need to think now. Um, so. Because if. I need to do math. Uh, so, eight, so I, I do plus think the way this 12. works is like. Um, is the same way that. What's his face works? Uh, Thousand Eyes Restrict works, where if you equip a face yeah. down card, it doesn't gain any attack or defense. Yeah, I think you're right. Okay, um, I'm actually gonna target the Caius. I think that's pretty correct. Gains half, so it goes up to 2k. Um, it's actually... This card gains attack. Yeah. Yeah. It gains 12, yeah. 2k. Um, if I activate this targeting Exa, then it is 24 plus 12, so which is 36. Yeah. 36. Which is close. Um, and then, yeah, that's what I do. Uh, call target fly. Sure, no response. Uh, fly effect. Yeah. For Hornet. Mm -hmm. Hornet target Santa or Mantis. Sure. Um. So then, does this go? Fly one, Mantis two, target Hornet, fly three. So sure. regardless, I'm getting two bodies on board. Okay, yeah, sure. That's fine. Um, gonna grab Hopper. Sure. And... This in defense. And then I can do that. Or that. Regardless... I do this. Ooh, interesting. Okay, sure. So that goes. Um, I've got two options. I can either go for a three or four, a four. I 
If we had Utopia, you can negate the attacks of my obelisk. God, I wish. <laughs> uh, I think I'd have to go for a three here. Sure. Um. No, I'm. I'm gonna. No, I'm not gonna do that. Uh. I'm going to activate. Hornet effect. Sure. Okay. Uh, lady effect, target fly. Yeah. Increase by one. Overlay. Yep. I don't know why I gave it three. Yeah, that's weird. Um, four. Meister. Ooh, okay, yeah. Um, and then I'm going to pass. Sure, draw. I should have equipped the face down. Yeah. I just I miss I miss mathed and I was like oh I can get over four k but I was adding the attack of the exostag which is me be stupid. That's okay. Um, let's see. I'm basically saying you have to use obelisk or I will stall you out forever. Hmm. Let's see. Like here's the problem is like. Uh... You can tribute himself. I could. I'm at 9k. <laughs> Is it weird that I almost want to do that? Yeah. I mean... You can. It, it puts you down to one card. Do I know the It puts me down to card? one card. Yeah. You don't, because I normal summon the dragonfly I searched off of the uh, centipede. Because I, I centipede searched fly and lady, and I started this turn with uh, normal summon fly. Yeah. Um, I'm kind of just like big chilling on the obelisk, is like the funny thing. Do with that. Is there a way for me to do this? There is, but it all feels so bad. That's the problem. The problem I am experiencing is just that everything feels terrible to do. Cause like, what could what could this back row be? Uh, it can't be judgment. Judgment doesn't beat this. Could be like a divine wrath, but that feels so strange for you to be playing in this deck of all things. Yeah, I mean, I guess we'll. I guess we'll go for it. I guess, yeah. Um. We will set a card, and then we'll obelisk effect. We'll tribute the two. Okay, um, that will destroy all monsters, correct? Uh, destroy all monsters before controls, yep, and then this card can't declare an attack. Yeah, and this will be protected. Yep. Yeah, I forgot about that. Um, it's still... It's still good for still you. A pretty big swing, yeah. Uh... Yeah, I'll just pass here. I'm kind of, I'm kind of sitting comfy on the, on the boy, you know. <laughs> oh, end phase. I do have to mandatory send mains. Yep. Um, I will set one pass. Sure, draw. Stand by main phase. Um. You know what, I, I, I just, I don't know, I don't know why, but I'm just so afraid of, like, everything you could have. <laughs> uh, okay. Plan hath been formed. Stand by main. Just set a card. Um, we've only got one hornet in green. 
I only have one Hornet, yeah, you know this. Yeah. I feel like, oh man, this is so strange. All right, I'm going to, we're gonna preemptively, I'm gonna DD Crow, I think, I, I think I'm gonna hit the Ladybug? That, that might oh, seem weird, okay. but that, I feel like the only way you're going to out- No, no, that does a lot. Yeah. That does a lot. And I'll just pass turn. Okay, uh, this is the end of the game. Oh, is it? Okay. <laughs> Flip. Not, sure. Normal. Sure. What could you do? Is it Black Rose? Oh, it's Black Rose. Okay. Yeah, that does nuke the field. Oh. Uh, 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 all right, so um, Zen mains can protect. Yeah, Zen mains can protect. And then um, um, get my Sangan search on resolution. Yeah, a little unfortunate that you had Sangan. I don't know what I even get. You know what? Let's just pick up. Let's let's pick up a copy of Gallus. Let's pick up the boy. I, I want to pick him up. He's fun. Okay. I'll pass it to you. Sure. Draw. Standby main phase. Hmm. What could I do? Uh, we'll just set. We'll say go. Okay. Stand by my main. main. Mm -hmm. Normal fly. fly. Yeah. Fly effect. fly effect. Fly effect. So, I just realized the set was judgment. I was, <laughs> I was afraid of that the entire time. Um. Fly is fine. I think. Yeah, go for it. Hornet. Hornet. Um, Hornet, Hornet target. target. It was Mystic Tomato. Didn't okay. Uh, fly fly effect. effect. Yep. Get right at the bottom, bottom of the barrel. barrel. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lady. lady. Sure. What is that? Twenty six. Yep, it'll get twenty six hundred events. It'll it'll come, come twenty six hundred events. Oh, yeah. uh, so battle, battle punch. punch. Just a thousand. All right. Yeah. yeah. Set, set pass. pass. Sure, draw. Stand by main. Um, wait, it'll yep, bump. yep. That. Also, also, you were you trying, trying to gallus FDK, FDK me. me. Yes, yes. With I the clock and I was. Um, is your, is your entire, entire deck, deck just, just monsters? monsters? Uh, it, it might be. <laughs> but the problem is, I just don't... I don't see... I don't... I don't know. I'm just kind of, like, not... There's probably a line, and I'm just missing it because I'm too tired. <laughs> uh, we'll just... You know, you know fair. Fair. We'll, we'll just keep going. We'll just set and pass. Okay, okay um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, just go just stand, stand by, by main, main and we'll, and lady, we'll lady effect. effect. Sure. 
Uh, uh, Hornet. Hornet. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Uh, I got, uh, two, I got options two options here. here. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's the play. The play. Uh, uh, gonna, gonna Hornet, hornet target. target. Wait, wait, Weevil. Weevil. Sure. Uh, uh, Weevil, Weevil effect, effect targeting, targeting Senta. Senta. Sure. Senta, Senta effect. effect. Yep. Uh, uh, Hornet, Hornet target, 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 target face, face down. down. Yep, it was a level eater. Senta, Senta effect. effect. Yep. Get the second Mantis. <laughs> I think it might be dead. <laughs> no. Oh, you're getting a ladybug. Okay. Oh, this oh, is this back, back down. down. Yeah. See, Lady Santa. Uh, oh, I don't know that yet. I think I, I think do, I do that. that. Uh, I got uh, multiple, multiple different things, things I can do here. here. So, so I can do that, that for, for that. that. Okay, okay, that's, that's the, play, the play, I think. I think. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's the play. play. Um, um, fly, fly effect. effect. Mm -hmm. lady. 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 Lady effect, effect target, target lady. lady. To make it a four. Interesting, sure. Oh, three, oh, three or, or four. four. I'm going to make, make it a, a, three. a three. Yeah. Uh, so what, we haven't seen the Levire out of you yet, or have we? No, we haven't. All right. Yeah, go for it. And then, and go, then go for... for... I could go Levire, or I could go Leviathan. Then... So I, might, I, might, I might have, have Weevil here. here. Um, um, I just need, I just need to think. think. I don't think I, don't I, think have, I have Weevil, actually. actually. Uh... Let's see. I think you... Uh, let's see. So it's 15, oh, oh, 18, 18. Uh, this uh, has, has to, to... Okay. okay, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, I have a lethal, lethal. Um, um, go for, go for Leviar, sure, uh, Leviar uh, effect, effect, target, target lady. the lady, special back, sure, lady, lady effect. effect, yep, for, men, men, Make it them. them. 24. 24. Yep. Uh, Hall. Target. Target. Air Bell. Bell. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, where are we going? We can go for a 6. What's 60? Go for a 6. six. Or, or so. so. 16. Or you just hit a card out. Actually, more if I, if I don't. don't. Um, um, switch, switch to attack. attack. Switch, switch to, to attack. attack. Sure. Battle. battle. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, uh, rip, rip a card. card. Sixteen. I get to rip a card. Uh, it's random, right? Yep. Yeah. 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 That, one. that one. Oof. Okay. Uh, it's effect failure. I just, I probably should have hit the Leviathan. I don't know what to do. Do something funny. Five hundred. Yeah. Even, yeah, even, even if you didn't, didn't, I had ways, ways around, around that. that. Yeah. Uh, and uh, then twenty-four. Twenty-four. 18. 18. It's not, it's not lethal, lethal, it's 200, 200 off. 15. Uh, main, uh, main 2. two. Mm -hmm. Gonna, go Gonna go for... for... There's, a, there's good a good play, play and there's, and a, there's funny a funny play. play. Screw, Screw it, funny, funny play. play. Um, um, we're going, going for it for Wu Wiz Nose and, and passing. passing. Alright, let's see. Draw. Stand by main. Uh, well, it's not terrible. It's not good either. I'll uh, normal Ryo. Okay. okay. I'm, trying I'm trying to, to think, think of a way, of a way that you can, can actually, actually like, like, like get out, get of, out this. of this. I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't think, think there, there is. is. Yeah, I'm. 
I'm probably gonna get flamed in the comments for just not seeing it, but I, I really don't. I'm really not figuring it out because I feel like everything can lose to, like, yeah. Yeah, I, I really don't think I have it here. <laughs> That's so funny that I lost. <laughs> How many how many spins? Hey, you man. <laughs> uh, that's a good question. Um, let's do. Hmm. Let's do five for the amount of monsters I summoned from the graveyard that last game. <laughs> All right, one, two, three, four, and five, and you are getting. Ooh, that's dangerous. Uh, you spawn a snatch deal. I have no idea what you possibly take, because <laughs> you banned... I don't either. <laughs> you banned the two good cards that you didn't have. Or, well, you had BLS, but you banned the Return from the Different Dimension. You could take a copy of Super Uju, but I don't know how much that matters when we're... That feels bad. ...weeks away from the the good set, the, the good dragon set. Um, what are your XYZs looking like? I, I could just get myself, like, a second... A second copy of like uh, the you threes, could, like Leviathan could, or Leviathan. Yeah, I have Leviathan, Leviathan, and I think I have Logia, and I think I have like Crimson Armor Ninja, and like maybe a couple of other cards. Um, I, I'm gonna ask for some screenshots. Yeah. <laughs> all right, but that is all from us, guys. Hope you did enjoy. Sorry about the misplays. Um, oh, is it not capturing my audio? It might not have been. I know it was. Okay. Uh, if you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a like. And if you really enjoyed, make sure to subscribe. But that is all from us. And you will, uh, we will see you in the next one. Peace.